All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahushah, Ba'ashim Rakaq Kudash. want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is here, Shalom, to all the Akim out here that's doing the pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay, I want to go on this topic of um, you don't need to be uh, book smart or uh, have a, a college degree and all that stuff in order to get the understanding or comprehend the uh, scriptures, okay? Now, um, the word comprehension, um, which I'm also going through the etymology of that word, okay? The word comprehension is the, uh, the action or capability of understanding something, okay? Now, comprehension... The etymology of it is a uh, act or fact of understanding from the mid 15th century. Okay, directly from a uh, comprehensionum. Okay, a season laying hold of arrest, uh, figuratively perception or comprehension. Okay, to take together, to unite, include. Okay, perceive. To seize or take in the mind. Okay. It says. Um, with together here probably. So the thing is that. Um, when it comes down to getting this. This um, this truth. Okay. You don't you don't have to. To be. A, 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 a major. Theologian. Or anything like that. Okay. In order to get this, this truth. Because it's, it's spiritual. Okay, you have to be uh, humble, be meek. Okay, but um, the word cognition, okay, which I'm also going to get that definition in uh, etymology, okay, which that means the mental action or process of acquiring acquiring knowledge or understanding through thought, experience. In, in the senses okay so basically uh, it, uh, it also means this uh, discernment okay learning understanding you see the thing is that in these school systems okay they don't teach you anything now um, the Lord you know put the spirit on me to uh, be decent okay and um in in uh in school and to, to to know certain things, okay. But this truth ain't about um uh being on the principal's list and um being on an honor roll and stuff like that, okay. Now one of the reasons that that uh sparked me to do this video is because um as I'm out at work and um I'm driving. My job requires the people that um, I deal with to have some type of understanding as far as uh, reading. And um, when I approach the people, okay, they, they basically um, don't understand what the heck um, is going on. You know, a lot of, a lot of people here in Baltimore, they, they don't know how to read, okay? And, and guess what? The Bible is a book that requires you to uh, to read. You know, but but the thing is that these people out here they 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 know how to go on the um the the internet, use social media, look up things on Facebook and, and Instagram and, and stuff like that. But when it comes down to reading some some simple words, okay. Let's say three words. They don't. They don't understand that. Okay. They can't. They can't grasp. Grasp those. Those. Um. Those words. And it's. You know. It's like. Why. Wow, wow. You know. But the the word cognition. Okay. The etymology of it. Which the word etymology means the the study of truth behind words is the ability to comprehend. Okay. To grasp what's to, the understanding. Okay. It says. A mental act or process of knowing. 
a getting to know acquaintance knowledge to get to know recognize okay to 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 together which is calm and know okay so so the thing is that a lot of people they lack basic um perception or or um um mental capability of of knowing things simple things now that's that's in this this world okay now yeah yeah it's a good thing for you to to, to be able to know uh certain things like of course it's it's good for you to know how to how to read and write okay now we living in a society where the so-called white man took away that privilege from from our people okay if you was if you was taught how to read or write then then guess what you was put to death okay and these people out here that you know don't don't get that 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 concept of knowing how to read and write they're nothing but the same people back then that that you know didn't know how to read and write back back then in um in slavery mo most likely okay but when it comes down to this truth you don't need to know how to read and write okay you don't need to you don't need that 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 uh that that um ability it's a good thing to have but but this this truth is all spiritual okay and i'm gonna prove those things with scriptures okay first off i'm gonna get this scripture uh proverbs 1 and 1 and 7 the fear of the lord is the beginning of knowledge okay so if a man fears the most high the one that created him okay and and that that's the beginning that now we now we're talking okay because guess what you grasp you grasping a, a a major major key because guess what the spirit can reveal certain things onto certain people okay and you might not be able to to, to understand it you might you might not be somebody that that that's that's good at, at reading and writing but the lord may have revealed something onto you through 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 the spirit through a, a vision or something like that and you end up going going to go um link up with with one of the brothers okay and and guess what one of the brothers break down like for example the fact that america is going to be destroyed with thermonuclear missiles okay so so that regi registers with, with with your thought because guess what you can see that you can see that that so-called white man is the devil like i said this 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 school system don't teach you these things okay but but guess what the fear of the lord that'll teach you these things the things that you need to know the things that have really profit you it says but fools despise wisdom and instruction and more than likely you got a lot of these people okay that 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 don't know how to read or or or, or write okay or, or or comprehend simple things okay they're not going they're not going to really uh take heed on to to, to this word okay because it's a it's a pride thing with with a lot of these people okay it, it and it goes down to them being foolish they was they was foolish in school okay and they don't want they don't want to get it now here in baltimore you got these these niggas okay using this word um um dummy is a is a term of en endearment okay they'll say what's what's up dummy you know Oh man, what's what's going on, dummy? Like like that's that's the word new word new way to uh to say things, okay? Now you know that following if a, if a little child is following behind the crowd, okay? And, and 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 let's say that child is doing something good, being around other people that that are calling them dummy, that's gonna make them feel like oh well, even though I was doing good, you know I don't wanna I don't wanna do good because, hey I'm, you know I know that um. It's, it's counterproductive basically you know yeah i'm doing good but th this person is calling me a dummy so guess what i'm gonna go and go out here and, and, and prove that i'm a real i'm really a dummy you know so a lot of these people out here in baltimore they they really dummies man at the end of the day so that word really fits them okay proverbs 18 and 15 the heart of the prudent get gets knowledge okay a man that's that, that's able to see his future Okay, and I'm not talking about future here in America, 
because these people, you don't, you don't got no future in America. This is not your rest. But the, the, the spiritual um, sense of what you're supposed to be doing, okay, you, it, it's supposed to register with your mind. It says, and the ear of the wise seeks knowledge, okay? And it's, it's a lot of knowledge out here to be, uh, to be uh, sought after. If you look at the, the, all the videos that brothers are putting out online, but guess what? People would rather go on um, on the internet, on the Facebook. They know how to type in that word, Facebook, okay, or Instagram and stuff like that, and look at memes. But when it comes down to, let's say, just type in the letter GMS on the YouTube, that's easy. There's only three letters, GMS. And that, that right there will, will open up the floodgates to so much knowledge out here. And all you have to do is just sit there and listen. Okay? Because we break down everything for you. Okay? Proverbs 9 and 9. Give instruction to a wise man. And he will yet be wiser. So if you don't if you don't know how to read and write. Okay? Or, 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 or uh, spell. Which that, that spelling really ain't no... No, um, no, uh, good excuse to not know how to spell. Because a lot of these phones, they have, um, spell check on them. And if you see that red line on, on the phone, okay, and you, you typing in a word and you see that it's, that, that's more than likely mean that you misspelling the word. Okay. Now, the brother, um, Karat is in, in my camp. Okay. The head, head of the Baltimore camp. You know, me and him had uh, a conversation about this topic earlier, and um, he was he was also saying that that a lot of a lot of guys in these other camps they don't they don't um have have the um uh, the, the 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 ability to 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 uh, comprehend what's going on, okay? To have that true understanding, okay? Like like the fact that the the RFID chip is the mark of the beast, okay? They don't get that. That's why the scripture says, give instruction to a wise man. He will yet be wiser because a wise man is going to know whether he know how to read, write, or whatever. That, that hey, you ain't supposed to take that chip. Okay, it says, teach a just man. He will increase in learning. We're not supposed to take that chip. Guess what? We're supposed to wait for Yahweh's side to return. Okay? Yahweh by some Yahweh's side is going to destroy America. Okay? And we got to do what we got to do. To, 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 to make sure that we write. Okay? So so a wise man and a righteous man is going, going to increase in learning if it's for him. Okay? And and this truth will help you do that. This is um Second Timothy 3 and 16. All scripture is given by inspiration of God, which is all spirit. It's all spiritual. And it's profitable for doctrine. For reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto all good works. Okay. Now, um, I'm gonna get this um one last scripture, and I'm gonna um end it on that one. Okay. Um, no, you know what? I'm going to keep going. This is uh, second, 1 Corinthians 2 and 1. And I, brethren, when I came to you, came not with excellency of speech or of wisdom. So it's not about um, being extremely eloquent when we, when we speak, okay? Declaring unto you the testimony uh, of God, or Yahweh B'Shem Yahweh okay? If I determine... Not to know anything among you, save Yahweh Sai and him crucified. Now, another example is when the apostles, when the when the um, people came to meet meet up with um, Peter and James. Okay, they thought that they was uh they were stupid. Okay, but but guess what? They they proved them wrong. Okay. I believe it was Peter and James. I know Peter was uh was was one of them. Okay. 
got to try to find that uh, scripture. Okay. Um, I, I believe it's in the book of uh, Acts. Okay. I believe it says something about they was basemen or something like that. Oh, here we go. Um, this is Acts 4 and 13. Now, when they saw the boldness of Peter and John and perceived that they were unlearned and ignorant men, because what? They thought that they didn't know anything. They marveled and they took knowledge of them that they had been with Yahweh Shah. And that's, that's what it's all about, man. Okay? Wanting to be with Yahweh Shah. Okay? Not this, this, this trash language that, that we know. Okay? Which is a good thing if you, if you can know that so that you can further edify our other brothers. Okay? This is um, continuing on. 1 Corinthians 2 and 3. And I was with you in weakness and in fear and in much trembling. And my speech and preaching was not with enticing words of man's wisdom, but in demonstration of the spirit and of, of, uh, of power, that your faith should not stand in the wisdom of men, but in the power of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh So it's not about, you know, be, having a bachelor's degree or, or a master's degree, okay? So, continuing on, I'm going to get one more scripture where it talks about, um, basically how, how, um, how things are. If you, if you lack anything, okay, it's just John, James 1 and 5. If any of you lack wisdom, okay, let him ask of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh that gives to all men liberally and upbraids not. And it shall be given to him. So if you don't know how to comprehend something, okay, and put it to good use, ask the Lord, man. And the Lord will increase that, increase your learning, okay? But this truth, it, it's, you're not required to have no master's degree, okay, or, or, or theo, the, theologian degree, okay, to... to, to to basically uh, get the understanding of this this truth, man. Okay. So um, with that, man, um, I want to say uh, salawam.